Hi guys, it's your girl Ina here. So I wanted to do a quick video talking about the first month of being monetized with my YouTube channel because I know a lot of people are curious like how much do YouTubers actually make and I just wanted to give you some facts and figures about my personal channel and how many views I got and how many hours and all these things so you can kind of get an idea of really how much money you can make or really how, uh, keep it transparent how much money I'm making and um, sort of give you an idea of what's going on with all of that. So first thing you might notice I have on my original Kids Camp Green t-shirt, which I wore probably for my first 40 or 50 videos. And everyone kind of asked me, why did you stop wearing it? And it's because I got a lot of feedback that people would see when a new video would pop up, especially if I was sitting in the same place, they would think that they've already seen the video because I always had the same t-shirt on. So I started changing up my clothes so that if something popped up, they would see from that thumbnail that it was a video they hadn't seen already. Whereas before, sometimes people were missing new videos that came up because they felt that they had seen them already. So that's why I don't wear this all the time anymore, but I'm gonna wear it today since we're talking about my channel and I always wore this in the beginning. So going back to the roots here. Okay, so I was monetized December uh, 1st. I reached all of my, my goals and all of that to reach the monetization. And to reach monetization, you have to have 4,000 hours and a uh, in a 12 month period, you have to have 4,000 hours of viewing time, meaning people have to watch your videos for, for 4,000 hours. So that's kind of, for me, that was the hardest part to get to. I got to that in a little over six months, six months, and I think it was six months and um, 11 days or something it was. Um, you also have to have over a thousand subscribers, which right now I'm at 2,276. It's been as high as 2,000. Uh, 277 this week and as low as 2,273. So that kind of goes up and down. If people don't like stuff, they unsubscribe, new people subscribe. So that kind of varies. Um, so, so I've only been paying for, for one month. So to give you an uh, idea, now December, since I got monetized, of course I was more motivated to put out a lot of videos. Cause it was like, you know, I mean, people, your, your, your people are motivated by money. That's, I mean, it's a sad fact, but it's a fact. So I was really motivated. I put out 17 videos. I don't normally put out 17 videos in a month, but this month I did. And also because I was in the hospital for part of this month, I had pre-recorded a lot of videos so that I had stuff to put on because I didn't know when I was going to be able to do videos and that sort of thing. Um, so I had a lot of material already ready that I just had to put up there. So again, 17 videos. The videos themselves come to 2.6 hours of actual video time. So the actual filming time of the videos in the month of December were 2.6 hours, only the filming time. Now, um, that doesn't include you know, if I have to splice things together in iMovie, that takes time, obviously, to create the thumbnail takes time, to upload it takes time, to write a description, all that stuff, to post it, la la la. That also takes some time too. So it's not just 2.6 hours of work. You could probably double that. So probably f about five hours of work total. Um, so um, with 17 videos and 2.6 hours of material, I had in the month of December, around 600, um, plus, a little bit more than 600 hours of viewing time. That means people went to my channel and watched my videos for about 600 hours in one month. So just think about 600 hours, 24 hours in a day. That's a lot of hours. Um, and my videos had around 8,000 views. So there were around 8,000 views for about 600 hours of viewing time. So I'm gonna let you think about that. <laughs> What would you think? <laughs> this is my little workstation, by the way, because I I, um, I don't work at my uh, my office anymore because I, I had that surgery. So I'm down here, so I've got all my stuff sort of set up here. So it looks kind of disorganized. It's actually very organized. Um, so anyway, guess how much guess how much I made? The popular question is, do you make enough money to live on? And I'm going to tell you, absolutely. You absolutely make enough money to live on. Like I could totally quit my job tomorrow. I just have to figure out how. I'm going to live on like $35 a month. If I could figure out how to live on $35 a month, I'm gonna be good. So it came to, I think, exactly 33 francs and 51 raffin, but in dollars, I think the dollar. Anyway, it's about $35, I think. I would have to really Google it, but in that area. So for five hours of video time, five, 2.6 hours of video, about five hours of working time, 600 hours of viewing, 8,000 views, I made 
in Swiss francs, 33 francs, 51 or about $35. So that'll give you an indication of how much you have to really do to make a living. And I don't mean $35 a day, I mean 35 in the whole month. So just give you an idea of how much YouTubers make. Um, so if you are interested in starting a YouTube channel and you do think that this is a way that you're going to get rich, I wish you all the luck and I really hope that you do it. In my particular situation, this is how much money I made in the first month um, with 17 videos. So have a think about it. Um, it is kind of a lot of work, but it's fun. I mean, it's fun work. It's also fun. You can be creative and stuff. And the positive side of this is once you get to the point where I am, where you're already monetized, maybe you have a video that goes really big. My original viral video that had 15.5 million views on, on you on Facebook, if that would have been on my channel and if grandma had balls, she'd be grandpa. But if that would have been on my channel, I could look at between... 30 and $45,000 profit off of that one video, but it wasn't on my YouTube channel that went viral. It was on somebody else's Facebook. So just to give you an idea, now that everything's up and running, if something goes viral again, if that video goes viral again from my channel, obviously it'll be a different story, but um, that just gives you an idea of what you can expect. So if you have any questions, you know, you guys can always ask me questions if you have questions about um, how all, any of that works. Um, you have a handy dandy thing on um, I don't want to show my personal information, but handy dandy thing on YouTube where it break, really breaks down all your analytics where you can filter and see from seven days, 28 days, 90 days, 365 days, your lifetime on YouTube, your, your views, your hours, and you can filter it down to a smaller period of time so you can really kind of see what's working and what's not working. Um, but yeah, hope that gives you an idea of what you can look for in YouTube. If you have any questions, let me know and have a great day.